I think anyone who does coffee professionally will tell you that you're always chasing it. Our approach to coffee is similar to that of a, of a chef or a restaurant um, where we look for great ingredients. So Chris travels a lot and meets coffee farmers, tastes coffee all over Central and South America. Once it gets here, you know, to put it kind of abruptly, our, our job is not to mess it up. So the roaster's job is to taste the coffee and develop the roast according to what's inherent to the coffee. And then from there, we still have to brew it and make it taste good. So the barista's job is to taste and adjust. I've had probably 12 different careers and had a hard time finding anything that really drew me in. Prior to being in coffee, I was uh, went to culinary school and I learned to cook and I cooked for a few years. What ultimately happened is I, I ended up taking a, like a one-day espresso class four years ago probably um, at a roaster called Cuvée Coffee down in Texas and it just blew my mind. The role of the coffee bar in today's society is, is really interesting and it's pretty important. A lot of people use coffee bar for an office, it's a meeting place, it's a place to have a social interaction with strangers or people you will probably run into that you know. And we wanted to just create a venue that was truly an epicenter of the community. We want to make people happy. You know, we love making coffee, we love sharing it with people, we want to make it accessible and understandable to people. And we just want to we just want to provide a really positive experience 